Any state, any entity, any ideology that fails to recognize the worth, the dignity, the rights of man, that state is obsolete. It has one iron rule. Logic is an enemy and truth is a menace. This gentleman has to be here as of the You are you are unable to videotape TSA and their procedures. Am I? Can I reach right here in my pocket without being shot? Would you like to read TSA procedures? You cannot video that. I am trespassing you from the airport immediately. Trespass for what reason? For filming. For filming. A First Amendment protected activity. Okay, let me ask you this. Are you going to leave like he just asked you to? Under threat of violence, I will leave. I just want to be okay, clear you here right that you're asking no me to questions. leave a public... No other questions you cannot anything. video you can leave right now. You can't. You can't. No, even though the TSA says it's allowed. What's your name, sir? Steve what? Okay. I will absolutely leave now that you folks have realized that you have violated my First Amendment right. Have a nice day. Time to leave. Let's go. Did you get his, uh, his information? No, this is the St. Pete Airport. This was the one I was trespassed from two weeks ago for filming the TSA checkpoint. So we're going to go back in and here's the checkpoint right here. I figured I'd take you guys live so you can see that, you know, once you... Uh, once you assert your rights, know your rights, and they know they're wrong, we're going to get some changes. It is beautiful out here. Oh, yeah, St. Cloud. I was just out there last week. Had a buddy that lives out there. <laughs> I'll look for his phone while I'm here. Claremont, what's up? I was out there at South Lake County Sheriff's Department a couple weeks back. Pensacola. I see and stuff like that, but yet you're here. So not giving any regard to other people's privacy. There's no privacy in public. Mm -hmm. Right. So we all know the plain view doctor. Just arrived, okay, and he'll he'll be able to discuss it with you. Um, you know, he, he obviously knows, you know, obviously he's a supervisor for a reason, okay? Yeah. Um, but they as a business do wish to not have you guys here any further, okay? okay. Well if it's so, a, if it's a state probation office and the general public's allowed, then, then I'm allowed. No, you're not. Up, up to a point. Up yes, to the point where they... Leave, you don't leave, you're going to go to jail for trespass after one. So, the okay. staff has asked them to leave already? No, they haven't asked us to leave. The lady actually has told me to wait. I'm here making a public records now. request. Yeah. So, in order for them to uh, to deny a public oh, records yes, request, they just asked to leave. Once I told you what recording... And if they did not leave, I would call over. All right, guys, time to go. And they said, and they refused to leave. So this is the second time. Okay, so how do I fill a public records request with this office? You guys do. I'm, I'm not trying to, you know, bug you anymore. You have to, you have to get off of the property, okay? Um, so they... Yeah, do you guys... Um, nope. Make sure you guys don't come back on the property, obviously, because then it is trespass after warning, okay? This is your warning whether or not it's in paper or not. Um, you okay. can't come back. If you do, you will be Can I get names and badge numbers of everybody here, please? Uh, can we sure. get your name, please, so we can document this also? As soon as I get your name and badge numbers. Well, I'm going to give you a case card with our name and case number on it. Okay. Can I get your first name, please, sir? As soon as I get names and badge numbers. Sure. Okay. That's not how T. this Robertson, works, sir. Badge number 6168. Bode. What Sergeant Mucci. Manucci, not Mucci. What is it, sir? Manucci. Sergeant Manucci. Sergeant Manucci. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Good now. Good now. Thank you. Can I please have your name, sir? T. Robertson, 6168. T. Robinson. My first name is George. George? Yep. And your last name, Mr. George? Is not going to happen. How do I file a public records request with this office, then? I don't know. So just to, just to clarify, when I go into a, a public building 
As for public records, all they have to do is say leave, and they don't have to fill my public records. Is that is that what you're saying the law is? Maybe you should Google it. Well, is that what you're saying? You came in saying the law, if they asked me no, to leave, I had to leave. If you leave the property and you don't, then you go to jail. I don't know anything about your request. That's okay. something you need to learn about on your own. I don't have any idea about that. Well, I know about it. That's why I'm wondering why you, you guys are trespassing me when I'm here making an open records request. Well, because it's a private it's, property and they ask you to leave. It's private? It's not a state probation office? It is owned by somebody, so it makes it private property. When the state rents out, out a facility, there. when the state Sir, rents out... I'm not going to argue with you about what it is. I'm explaining to you what's going on. I'm not going to debate with you back and forth whether or not this is open to everybody who wants to come inside. Obviously it's not because they ask you to leave. Back at the Salvation Army, picking up my records request today. Told them I would be in today, this week. Pick that up. So let's see what they have to say. Hello ma'am, I'm here for my public records request. So it's a dollar forty to twenty cents per page. After eight pages. Mm -hmm. After eight pages. Okay. How many pages are here? Seven. Yeah. Do you want to read the law real quick? No. Yeah. It's fifteen cents a page after the first day. Okay. Is that good? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Thank you guys. No problem. Yep. Rooms out. There's no art up there, so oh, yeah. this you don't waste your time. Okay. More or less, everything's like down here. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I saw the bell on the way in. That's pretty. Oh, nice. you came in that way? What's well, no, name? no, I came through this way. Excuse me. What's your name? I don't give my name, sir. You don't give your name? No. I would like to remain anonymous. Okay. Well, you're not allowed to remain anonymous right here. Why not? Because. What, what state law is that? Listen, 
what statutes? Here's, that? here's the. Listen, just understand my suspicions. Okay. okay. When somebody comes in, they're taking pictures of the entryways and stuff of buildings. Mm -hmm. it, it alarms us. Okay. Understand? What's alarming so, about it? Because well, here, let me back up for a moment. You don't want to do terrorist attacks and stuff. You got to understand that. Do, do I look like a terrorist? We're responsible for it. I can't say. Right. <laughs> really? Because I don't know. Am I sure? All right. I see that. Okay. Lawman51blogspot.com. I record all interactions with government agents, which is my right, according to the Supreme Court. I don't have a problem. But you know we're going to ask. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, and I've had a nice conversation with this gentleman right here, and we've walked around and looked at art together. Just so I can notify the other people here so they know what you're doing. What's my name going to notify them of exactly? Just who you are. What? Is that going to give them some insight? It's going to give me insight, because I'd like to know who you are. <laughs> and then what? <laughs> Not everyday people walk through your thing. Well, well, of course. And it, Be, because yeah, again, it's our yes. job to get our get our Be, because get get and get excited that you Right. Yeah. Everybody goes through here. Yeah. Well, it's it's because I get harassed. Yeah. It's, it's, harassed. Harassed. it's a simple. Asking. It's yeah. a simple thing. I don't mind you taking yeah. pictures. Are you asking anybody else for their name? They're not taking pictures and yeah. videos. So, so, so you're singling me out for uh, first. If they were doing, first I would ask. Yeah, we do. Yeah. But they were asking. If they were doing it, I would ask them too. Right. But you understand this is a First Amendment protected activity, right? This is protected by the First Amendment. You see the freedom shine wall right there. Okay, so this is a First Amendment protected activity. You can't, you can't turn it into a suspicious yeah, activity. That would be like saying because I own a gun, that's a suspicious activity. So Any time that a well, we don't like or anybody comes here. and takes pictures, yeah, you can we definitely can, ask. Can't ask them. No, you can ask whatever okay. you want. We don't I'm know who you are. That's well, what I'm saying. asking you, and I'm declining. Okay, well then, well, the, <laughs> you need to leave the building. Yeah, you need to leave the building. Well, okay, a public building. If you have yeah. business here, you can be here. But I, you I don't do have, have business. business. What business do you have here? My First Amendment activity is my business. Now, what business do you have in the courthouse? I'm recording for commercial for and, and then... What um, commercial? Co commercial and what news purposes. Are, okay, what business well, I, I are you Well, I do a web blog. For? I do a web blog. Okay. For yourself or for somebody else? Well, for me, but other people watch then? it. I don't need an employer. The citizens have just as much... Uh, uh, access to information that the news agency does, according to Glick versus Knuff, and that's the Eleventh Circuit that does have. All right, we give you any information you want, but we're just asking for some information from you. And that's, that's perfectly for that, you know exactly. You got to understand that too. But but the problem is, is again, the authority in the state of Florida is no ID is required unless I've been suspected of committing a crime and I'm about to commit right, a crime. You understand that? Okay. But we don't know if you're about to commit but, a crime. Yeah. And giving it's you my name is not going to tell you that either. Is it? Yeah, but if you're not doing anything, is wrong, my name gonna? Is my is, then, is well be, because this is this is the whole rights thing. This is the whole. I have a right to do this. So basically, you're just out to stir up trouble. Yeah. Why? Yeah, why, why is that trouble? Why it is? is it? So it is. hold on, hold because on. Because I, 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 so, 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 so exerting my First Amendment right is stirring up trouble. Well, you're taking pictures in a government building. And, 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 and so who owns so the government so building? I'm asking. I do. I'm a taxpayer. I'm also a taxpayer. Right. So exactly. I. Oh, exactly. I, so, and you're and I, but I'm also employed. The building right. To, to, right. To patrol this. In your in your public right. capacity, you're you're here, but in your private capacity, you're a taxpayer just like me, and we own the building. I understand, but that's why I wouldn't come in here and take pictures of this and get get the law enforcement all excited when they could be doing something else. Well, We've got inmates in, in courtrooms and of everything. Of course you else. do. Yeah, I didn't ask you guys and to come over we, here. And we didn't tell you you had to leave. We just asked you your name. Well, I, well he, he told me I had to leave if I didn't give well, my name. Well, you don't. Well, we, we're, we're if you don't have business here, you don't, yeah. you don't need to be here. Am I the public? Is this a public? Does, does the public, the, the, hold on. What law makes it so Are the you public... Are to pick up papers or something or file something? or? What law makes it judge? so the public needs a reason to be on public property? Well, I've asked you some simple requests. If right. you're taking pictures of a government building. It's, so a, re it's a request. That makes you suspicious. I, I request yeah. from the auto dealership yeah. for a Lamborghini every week. Well, you know what? They deny me. A request can be denied. Right now, we find your activity suspicious. So What's suspicious about taking pictures? Can you articulate? This is can a you government building. So just because it's a government building. If I was taking pictures okay. of the 7-Eleven, would that be suspicious? You believe it might be the 7-Eleven. It might be the 7-Eleven. So taking pictures of anything is suspicious depending on who you're... Who's 
being taken pictures of. But listen, listen. Right? If I take a picture of my look, wife, look, can look, she look. find that suspicious? Maybe. Jesus. <laughs> What's your name That's and badge her. number, sir? That's her own thing. Sergeant Jablonski. 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 Yeah. What's your ID number, sir? 2522. 252. Sir? McCurdy. Now, McCurdy. Now, 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 I gave you mine. Absolutely. I'm right here. And why did you give me yours? Because you asked me. Are you a private citizen right now? No. Are you acting in your Are you in your, Are you acting in your private capacity? But I gave you my ID. I gave you why? My name. Because, because you asked capacity, for me. Though. Because, because you're in a public me. capacity. I asked you asked me for it. Because you have to. You're in a public capacity. You are making it. What is this? A consensual encounter? Is this consensual? Yeah. Or is this a talking to you? Okay. So you I'm, I'm free you, to go. Ask you. You are free to go. Yeah. See you later, gentlemen. Have a good okay. day. These people are actually going to help me. Do you have a record? I don't know. Did you request a record? Oh, no. I just asked a simple question. Oh. Okay. Hey, how y'all doing? Y'all auditing at us? Go right ahead. I'm just asking the simple I think question. I met you before. How are you doing? Good. Doing good? Good yeah. to see you. Yep. I was here last time. I saw both of you. Yeah, you're good. I saw all you guys three are good. Yeah, I just asked a simple question, just waiting on an answer. All right. Well, not, what not, would you not, ask? Not, not disturbing. Uh, summons, I wanted to know if I was uh, suing the city of Ocala, if I would have the summons served here, or if there was another office I'd have to go to, and how much it would be. Oh, I don't know. The date. It says summons right there. I just did asked. They ask, did they answer again? I asked. She disappeared. I haven't seen her since. Uh, I don't know. Good. You guys are good, girl. Yeah, I mean, we're not causing the disturbance. You're fine. Yeah. You guys are fine. Thanks. You guys are good one, right? Thank you, sir. Y'all have a good one. Yep. I was just wondering if I was to serve a summons for a lawsuit in the city of Ocala, mm -hmm. would that be served here? The summons that would through be the here? Second floor. Second as far floor. as who to serve it on, I do not know. This I, I already know who to serve. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is a family, so we don't have anything about lawsuits for that. This is only about family. Okay. So I was wondering. It said juvenile delinquents, but then I came in. It said summons, so I was kind of confused. Yeah, that's summons for family cases like divorces and adoptions and things like that. So okay. anything civil would be the second floor. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. All right, have a great day. Soon. Hey, Sergeant, how you doing? So, um, we went inside and found out that this is not the place where we would serve a summons for a lawsuit for a city of Ocala. It's going to be on the second floor. So it's going to be probably, we probably have to go to the elevator and, uh, and go on upstairs, but I want to find out about this glove. Service. Good. How are you doing? Oh, man. Came in to do an open records request. Open records request? Mm-hmm. Yeah. For what? 
Uh, I just want to know how many uh, in the inmates they had in the facility, how many beds they had. That's it. Okay. You got your ID on you? No. No ID on you? Mm-mm. Okay. No, I'm not breaking the law, so I don't carry ID unless I'm breaking the law. What's, what do you mean you don't carry ID unless you're breaking the law? Well, the only time people are allowed to ask for ID is if you're suspected of, in the process of, or about to commit a crime. 951.151. Florida okay. State statute. Well, you're, uh, you're here at a detention facility. Yeah, I know where I'm at. Okay. Yeah, and I'm here making an anonymous record request, which by Florida Statute 119 is totally allowable. Okay. I'm also allowed to record. They're handling public business. They all agree that they have a contract with the state. Do we have a contract with the state? He's talking to the cop. Okay. Hey. Okay. Hey. Okay. They have a contract so, with the state so to handle juvenile facility here. Mm -hmm. So I'm in here doing a public records request. Yep. Totally legal, okay. totally lawful. What kind of public records are you requesting? Yeah, that's not how you do it. What, you, you hey, hey, hey what, what kind of public request? What kind of public records are you requesting? I'm just looking to see how many inmates they have in the facility and how many beds. There's a problem with the juvenile facilities in the state over over filling. Okay. The so you're uh, doing kind of a documentation. Then, absolutely. Right? A document. Yeah, okay. yeah, and it's 119 Florida State Statutes Open Records Law. They have a contract with the state. They have to have those records. They have to be able to give them to me. Okay. I, I just how, came how, and I asked so, a simple how, question, and he freaked out on how, me. How how many days do they have to to give you those those records um, on your request? Uh, the custodian has, if it's available immediately and doesn't have to be redacted, then it should be available immediately, which is the kind of information I'm actually asking and I mean, for. Usually, usually, you have like a certain amount of days. That that's for stuff that has to be redacted or something like that. You know what I mean? If the okay. information doesn't have well, to be redacted. I, well, I know, I know some agencies they have to where you have to actually pay to get the records. Right. If you're getting copies of the records, a CD of a record. But like if, for example, if they have a sign-in sheet in there and I was to go in and request to photograph and copy the sign-in sheet, mm -hmm. I could just photograph it and request it. I was... God, I was just at yeah, five but, or six places there, in Ocala. There, there's, there's, different, there's different laws for... Different. I mean, you're at a detention facility. Yeah, yeah. And, the Florida State Statutes okay. 119 are the okay. same for every public entity. Right. It's the same thing. Okay. Doesn't matter. Well, prison. Right. Well, they're asking you to leave. Okay. okay. So, well, so, I, so, okay, listen to me. Okay. okay. They're asking you to leave. Okay. All right. You're disturbing their function. All right. The function of their facility. Okay. Well, let so me just listen to me. Okay. I'm going to ask you to leave right now. Okay. Can we clarify real quick? Okay. I'm going to ask you to leave right now. I understand what you're asking. Okay. I'm now ordering you. To leave right now. Okay. Okay. He was recording license plates out here. Okay. I don't feel safe at all because my car's out here. I'm ordering you to leave right now. Bye. Okay. Have a good day, sir. Okay. Can I get your name, badge number, yeah, Lockhart? Lockhart. ID number is 5333. 5333. Have a good day, sir. You too. All right, we got 100 people on. Let's go up here to the door, see if general counsel got through. Invectus, yes, Dr. Barry's here with me today. He's all the way out there in the parking lot right now. Anthony, don't be butthurt, buddy. You've never really had a one. Thank you, South Carolina. I'm getting them. Sorry about that. I'm trying to work these damn cameras. We have someone at the door. I don't know if they're coming out for me or if they're just coming out to leave. We'll see. What? You coming out to leave? Is anybody going to answer my request here, sir? General counsel's trying to call you. I wouldn't hang up on him. <laughs> no, Mark. Uh, the doc did. The doc's got the cigarette behind his ear today. 
The lady at Social Security owned you, bud. I haven't been a Social Security boss, but thank you if you were talking to me. A gentleman and a scholar. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, it doesn't look like they're coming out. This lady came out to leave, I guess, so. Nothing else to do here today, I guess. You got a good talking to the last time, since the last time you were here. Coming out to talk to me, boss, or? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just making a phone call to my wife. Oh. You guys okay? Oh, yeah, we're just here to do a public records request. They won't answer the door. We'll come back. Right. I'll tell them, I'll, tell them I'll keep coming back. But, I'm sorry, I'm just, like, just tell them I'll keep coming back. Yeah. Oh, Guys, I see you guys on the fence. Yeah. Rogue Nation, right? Yeah. First Amendment honors. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we were here like two weeks ago and they bombarded me and said I couldn't be here. So I called the lead counsel up in Tallahassee for the Department of Juvenile Justice. He's like, Yeah, you can be there and yeah, you can oh, make yeah. public record requests. So yeah. I came in today, they won't answer the door. I've got I'm live. I got 115 people live right now and they've been calling. They just hang up on them. <laughs> oh, man, I don't know anything about that, so yeah. I wish I could help more. But... No. Yeah. Well, you guys keep fighting a good fight. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. And it's, uh, it's important because uh, I am a pro First and Second Amendment guy as well. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you know, all, all people want to know is that everything's on the up and up. You know, I don't know if you heard the, the Dozier School for Boys. I'm not from around here, I don't. Know. No, there was a school for boys up in northern Florida, and over like a 40-year period, like 80 boys were beat, raped, murdered up there by state employees right and so i'm not saying that anything like this could be occurring here but you don't know unless you go check <laughs> right, <laughs> you right, know right. so i mean how did these guys get away with it for 40 years because no one went and checked uh, i suppose yeah. that would probably be the case i don't know <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know so. yeah they just found a whole bunch like 27 more bodies they found out there so it's a terrible tragedy uh, that could have been avoided by someone like me just going out and saying you know hey how is everything you yeah. know yeah. I mean, this is all our money. So am I going to be on YouTube? Yes, sir. Hi, Mom. <laughs> yeah, you're live. You're live right now. You're 100, 114. Public, so hey. Yep. Cool. Thanks, bud. Right, be safe, okay? Oh, yeah, we always are. Thank you. Where's the law? I'll show you. Come on over here. Okay. Is it Florida statute you take, or is it just a policy? Listen to me. You need to take it out of here. They want you to leave. You need to leave. Nobody, they, has to they, leave. Nobody yeah. asked me to leave. She has the man with the shirt. Yeah, leave, their office. Their office. She asked us to leave their office. Administrator, I'm asking you to leave our lobby to leave our building. Okay. Okay. All right. So let's go. Well, we're out this way, so we're going to go that way. I'll walk you out. Okay. And you show me the law that says it's illegal. Okay. Don't touch me, please. There was a a Florida statute attached to that, or is it just the public building policy? I'll show you. Just go well side. Okay. I feel like that's just a. You're just telling me you're going to show me, but. Yeah. Are you with it? Huh? Don't answer questions. Second? I do not answer questions. I'm not questioning. Okay. Hold on. I prefer you get all the weapons up before you have any time. Well, I prefer you leave the building. Um, Sir, this way. Uh, I just said we were out this way. I said we were going to walk out this door. Go out this door and you can walk out from around the building. All right. <laughs> is that a law, too? We have to follow your orders in which way we go? Okay. What law is that? We got to go out. They won't get out of the building. I'm telling you to leave. Okay. So we're being trespassed? You will be if you don't go on out. Well, if they're if they're asking us I to leave. I can't keep you for doing business in here, but you cannot be filming. Walk on out. Filming is my business. Walk on out. Yeah, that's 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 why we're here. Okay. okay. I'm gonna walk out, but I need to see a supervisor. Your court, supervisor. Yeah, yeah, what's that uh, member ID number? They asked you to leave, you need to leave. Can you give me Are you trespassing me? Because if not, I'm gonna come back in. What's your member ID? I don't have a Member ID. Badge number. ID number. Oh, they don't give you. It's your payroll you. ID. Yeah, 3421. So, are, okay, can I, I'm coming back in now. I thought you were coming out to talk to me. Huh? You're coming out to talk to me it's about the law. You leave. Okay, so okay. I've left. Now, I'm telling you, that's all you have to do is leave. Okay, I don't want to leave. Well, I'm, I'm not here to leave. I know. She's the administrator of this building. Listen, they're one. Don't over-trump my you, rights. But listen, you can't film people in there. I can film anybody in public. Okay, they're not wanting you to be filming that. I, you know what? Neither did uh, Casey Anthony. She didn't want nobody filming her in court. Me, dude. 
They want you to leave. You need to leave. I need to see a supervisor, and I need to see what? the law. Here's one of the, the city yeah, police officers. PD. That's not a law. Okay. You said you said you're going to cite a law that you were lawfully. They're wanting you to leave. leave. If you are not but leaving, you're, but you're, you're a law you're enforcement officer, not a, not a feelings officer. Right? I'm not. They yeah, say so they want you to leave. You're they want you to leave. They want, they want you out of the building. That means you're trespassing once they tell you to leave. Okay, so we we are trespassed then. Well, you said no to him. I'm not trust. You didn't say that. I'm telling you, she wants you out of the building. If I'm not trespassed... She don't want you filming in there in their business. If I'm not trespassed, I'm allowed to be in the building, correct? Listen yeah, to buddy. me. She told you to leave. She want, The okay. county administrator from this building wants you to leave the premises. When can I come back? If you're doing business. I, I am I'm doing business. No, you're not. That's not business. So a report, reporting, gathering content for a story is not business? Do we know the law here? Do we? Do we? Do they we? ask you to leave. I, you're interrupting their business. their business. You're interrupting their business by doing what you're doing. You know. So they want you to leave. Ro Ro Stop. Ro I don't want to hear no law stated to me. I don't want to hear nothing. Okay, you're on property. The people who own this property ask you to leave. If you do not leave, after I tell you one more time, you will be trespassing after warning. Understood. So can I get leave the property? So you're trespassing, trespassing me. after you warning. You I'm going to tell leave. you one more time. If you do not leave the property after warning, you will be going to jail. You understand? Yep. So property. That's called trespass after warning. We're not playing this game. Trespass after warning. All of your member ID. Trespass after warning. And we will get your name because you are, you are actually being detained at this moment. Am I being detained? lawfully for a complaint. So that means you are lawfully not able to Exactly. So you're going to stand right here. Now I want everybody to turn around for me, please. Thank you. I need everybody's ID. For what? You are being lawfully detained because there was a complaint called on all three of you. So you have no right to not give me any of your information. So, okay. I'm going to say this clearly. Someone called on you. Since someone calls, we have an obligation to figure out what's going on. So that means you are being detained. So we have So give me your ID, or you will be placed under arrest for failure to identify. Give me your ID, sir, or you will be placed under arrest. Yes, because someone called on you. Because you were on the property. I, I don't carry ID on me, no. So, we're going to do this one more time. They did not want to win your ID. Hold up. But first, before it settles down, I know. I want to see a supervisor. This should be a supervisor. You have somebody above you? Give me your ID. I don't carry ID. You don't carry ID on you. So you're doing all this with no ID? Absolutely. If it doesn't check out, arrest them. Can I have your ID, please? Um, I need to. Is there a statute that I have to ID without a crime? Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and ID so I don't get arrested, but this this will just be another lawsuit here. You're not going to come here with the whole law. Hang on, guys. Yes. You are on private property. Yes. They ask you, this is not a mystery. You are on the property here, correct? Yes, sir. They ask you to leave, correct? Yes. Okay, that is trust after after warning. I have to leave. I 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 leave. But that's why I had a Exactly. You need an ID or you will be placed under arrest if you have to identify. You understand? Even the, even the deputy knows it's wrong here. He's shaking his head. I'm not going to ask you to identify you. You're wrong. Give me your identification or your name and date of birth right now or we will obtain it in the Dakota County Jail until you have to take a plunger and arrest. That's fine. I am threatening to arrest you. Yes. You hear that, guys? Threatening to arrest? Yes, I am threatening to arrest you. This is Arcadia. Guys, go ahead and call his uh, supervisor, the watch commander. Paul. Yeah, he's out of his mind. Hold on. Let me get you away. I don't want you getting these guys' information. Well, we were walking out with this gentleman. I was trying to find out. I told you to leave the building. You should get your information, sir. I still need to talk to a supervisor for you. I am a supervisor. There's somebody, there's somebody above you. Come on over, Lieutenant.
these geezers up there. Commissioners. I Supervisor of Elections. An old historic map of Florida. Not sure if you can read that. Population numbers. Cool. Uncle Sam, you might remember him. I uh, did an interview of him in the Punta, G uh, Punta Gorda uh, Supervisor of Elections Office. What's going on here? Nothing really going on here. Pretty quiet. gentlemen here in the boardroom. This is where the police just came out of. So, DeSoto is a small county and Arcadia, which I believe is the biggest city in DeSoto, is pretty small as well. It's got a nice uh, downtown feel as you can see from the buildings here. Uh, it's got a nice old downtown feeling. Fishing. He also has an AR-15 and a Glock. 